Hello and welcome Pisces. This is your April 2023 general reading with myself, Thomas Janak. Please like, subscribe and share widely. And if you like my work, you can buy me a coffee on buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. That's buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. Now Pisceans, what we do here, we will divide the readings, the reading in sections, so it's a bit easier to give the messages and for you to understand the messages ultimately. So what we will do is we will look at the overall energy for the month of April 2023, before we then look at your emotional core, see if there's healing coming in, if there's anything that needs to go, that kind of stuff. And then lastly, we will look at opportunities as they present themselves to you in the month of April 2023. Are you ready? Here we go. Okay. <laughs> For us Pisceans, and I say us because I'm a Piscean too, we are asked to spend a lot of time in nature and to slow down, right? So here we have two, I work with the Starseed cards and, and, and today, which I, which I hardly ever use. They just came to me today for actually four signs and with the last sign that I'm using them for, but they come in for a reason. And both cards here, which are different, one is called Earth Pulsing, which means slow down. The other one is the Void, which means stop. <laughs> Uh, and embrace what is known as winter. So, so it's about, you know, um, there's a lot of snow, there's a lot of stuff that, that puts things at a hold. Don't overdo things in April, dear Pisceans. And that includes myself. If you feel you're being a bit pushed, push back. Right? Don't overdo things. You are not here to prove your love to others. Really, really important. If they don't see your love, just because in their mind you're not doing enough uh, for them, and this is work-related and, and private, that's not on you. right? If people can't feel you, then that's on them, not on you. But the point here is, and this is the, the strong point for the over energy for April, for our, our sign of Pisceans, is go slower. Really, go slower. It is okay not to be as efficient as, uh, as you are. And remember, we're the sign of the dreamer. While we're very efficient, um, we also like our little dream worlds, dreamscapes, and our little escapism. So let's do that, shall we? Good. So here we go. That was the overall energy for the month of April 2023. Now, let's look at um, your emotional core. Let's see if there's healing needs to happen or love coming in, that sort of stuff. Right. So, <laughs> oh, that's interesting. You have the Whale and Orca Elders. And the Whale and Orca Elders are about understanding where you're from. You are a reflection of the universe. So when it comes to your emotional core, always understand that you are part of a much wider universe and that your depth, while threatening to others even sometimes, is your biggest strength. If you have ambitions, don't allow anyone to piss on them. Right? Just because they haven't got ambitions. Really, really important. And again, guides are a bit in your face here, or in our face here. But that's that's because not everybody sees that what you do makes sense to you. And it doesn't have to make sense to anybody else but you. Don't break the camera, sweetie. Sorry, sorry, Fitch. Come on, man. So, is it right? Oh. Anyway, so where were we? Yes, Wade and Orca. So, remember this. You know, our home is the stars, you're part of it. And what you're being asked is, and it sounds a bit weird, number one, obviously the guides have said, slow down a little and actually stop. But we are doing this, as Pisceans, in order for us to forge a new path rather than follow the old one. Maybe it's time to remove yourself from something. I'm going to go, okay, this has come to an end. Or... Oh, I know it's coming to an end. So maybe while the time still plays out for this to end, right? So if you have prior commitments, obviously, um, as a Piscean, you will want to make sure that you honor all the contracts that you have. Really, really important. Also important for, for Pisceans by default um, to not do things that aren't finished, right? Or, or, or stop things halfway through. The point is, you are being asked, or we are being asked, when you look at your life, to forge your own path and be the leader that you probably didn't know sits inside you, right? Be your determined self, okay? 
that's what I'm getting for us Pisceans. I also am fully aware that that could come with, with you sometimes losing your cool. So remember, be calm, be kind. Okay? So let's look at your emotional core. See what comes in. Let's have a look. Wow. Love that. Our job, your job and mine, like I said, I'm a Piscean too. It's all about connections and connecting to the universe. Anything to do with deep healing, super important. Um, just as a, as a, on a personal note, I bought myself a hang pen drum, which is super spiritual. And playing that thing is really difficult. So it will take me quite some time before I feel I'm proficient. But when I play the sounds, I do feel, oh my God, this is so pure that I connect easier. And yes, I should probably be able to do this without a hangpan drum. And I do meditation a lot. Right? Uh, if I dare say so myself, I'm quite proficient at stuff. That said, if, you, if it is easier for you to have, um, to use a tool, like a sound tool, or maybe you do a certain thing that gets you deeper into your healing, by all means use that. But when it comes to emotions, not just love, but also healing and things letting go. Um, again, there's no distinction here this month, so so it's not that we have to focus more on on love or, or more on healing. It's all one. But the point is, uh, there's two things here. We have the Seven Sisters. Now, the Seven Sisters is, is a story where there was a group of women and uh, they did a lot of hard work and then um, their men were out trying to hunt and anyway the, the men would always be pestering them and eventually they said fuck it we're gonna leave <laughs> that's the story and so they didn't know where to go because the, the husbands were chasing them again it's a story point is eventually they found an elder and the elder says well i can turn you into stars um but then you have to leave earth and they agreed and now they are a tiny constellation uh, um you know which is now known as Taurus, actually. Right? So, point is, there are seven stars, and one of them is already a bit burnt out because there were six women and a, and a female child. The point is, you have the seven star sisters. So, your life, our life, is illuminated. So, things that we need to figure out by us just allowing ourselves to, to, to calm down a little, right? feel things as deeply as we're capable of feeling it, answers will come much quicker when we do just that right so and then lastly let's look at opportunities for the month of april 2023 are you ready pisceans here we go this is about connecting and you have inner or we have inner earth and and mother's milk so the point is and again, it's, it's a continuation of our emotional core. Opportunities for this month are not as abundant or as numerous as some of us or some of you would probably want them to be. But number one, you have to understand that you are part of Earth. right? The, the, the symbolism is that no matter what, you've, what you're going through, you will survive this. right? So have some faith in your abilities to not... To not lose the sense of self if there is a crisis if that makes sense and you have um mother's milk which means you are being sustained uh, by the universe of which you are an integral part and um and then there is on this path here we have a we have a portal and that portal portal is birth so while we're sitting there if that makes sense so while not many opportunities are coming our way once we're realizing you know what even though there's no opportunities, that's just a way of testing me. Do I get annoyed? Do I get fearful? Do I get worried just because not much is happening? No. You might, but it's not helping you. So just relax. Nothing ever stays difficult, right? Um, and that's sort of what I'm getting for the opportunities this month. They might not be forthcoming as, as easily as you think, but that is perfectly fine, especially because the guide said earlier to stop. So when you, when you are energetically speaking, are in like okay let me, let me just stop here a second obviously um that also uh, sends a note to your opportunities no point sending it to the person because they're obviously in stop mode so 
It's not a negative thing. Really, really important for us Pisceans to understand that we are the sign of the dreamer. So let's dream. Okay? Guys, that's all we have time for. That's all we got. Um, please like, subscribe and share. It really, really does help the channel. Right? And um, if you like my work, you can now buy me a coffee on buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. That's buymeacoffee.com forward slash medium Thomas. See you all next month. Bye bye.